All right, so we're gonna do a launch right now with kinesis.gg. Um, my setup is really, really simple. Um, so let me go ahead and dive right in right now. Just so you guys can see pretty much uh, how simple this whole entire thing is. And I'm only using like right now 2.9 Solana, which, you know, I wanna show you that dreams really can come true with that low amount of Solana. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and go into our computer and let's jump into what's going on. I have three different groups here. Uh, I have a buy and hold group, uh, a dev group, which is just like one dev wallet, and then another one for volume per se. Again, this is just a test that I wanted to show you guys uh, in regards to this in particular bundler. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into our um, pump vision. So let's go into they change it again. All right, there we go. New creations. All right, cool. So let's go ahead and go into um, the actual task or hand. Okay, and right now this is going to we're gonna go ahead and grab our dev wallet. So let's go back to our wallet section, and we're gonna go to the dev section here, and we're gonna go ahead and copy the private key. From there, we're gonna go back into our um, to our tasks, new tasks. We're gonna go ahead and put the dot dev private key there. Uh, 0.95 would be the uh, buy amount. We're gonna want the vanity to be a pump vanity, vanity, and we're gonna clone that particular CA right here. Let's clone that one, and here we are. All right, so now we can hit start. Now, once we hit start, we're gonna see it here on our left side, which is new creations. So we're looking for a Gayotu statue. Oh, there it, is. there it is. Boom. So we got like a couple buys come in right that. As you see, 3.29% here. What I also can do is you can see right here where it says the buys, the sales. I can go ahead and do 100% sell on them right now. And as you see, that will go ahead and show that. Now, I also want to show you on this how to use your tasks as well. Uh, it's very simple. You simply want to go on to tasks here. Sometimes people like myself or they'll, will have uh, multiple different, um, you know, tabs up, which I, I mean, I think that was also pretty cool to do. I just sold from my dev wallet, but to do so, you can simply click on that left hand one or either, either one will work. So let's click on here and I have, have volume. So now it's saying, okay, well, you want to put volume, great, but what do you want to do? And what's your minimum, what's the maximum buy? So uh, with this particularly, I will make sure we're putting the right contract in there. We're going to be using this Kinesis volume wallet here to do a minimum buy of 0.2 and the max buy of 0.3 or 0.35 yeah, baby. The delay we'll do is three seconds, and the slippage we'll do is uh, 25%. So as that's happened, by the way, if we look over here, a couple buys came in. I'm gonna refresh the page here. So a couple buys, nothing too crazy, I think, here. But anyways, let's go ahead and run this volume so that way we can see this is running in action. So I'll go ahead and select the volume that says there and I'll hit start. By doing this, it's going to take this Kinesis group wall that I've created here, with this only one that has 1.1 soul, I'm gonna do a 0.2 to 0.35 buy every three seconds. Um, that's what we're gonna see, with a slippage of 25. So let's start. And as you see, those are coming in right now. Okay. And now we will wait a couple more seconds. And I think we should be good. We have now um, bought it with one contract. We have one, two, three that just came in. Now, if we wanted to do more, we can also hit plus. We can go back into the volume and we can set up our volume task for um, a completely different sector. So for example, I have 0.23 five in each of these wallets. I could set the minimum buy to let's say 0.112 to point, let's say one nine with a three, two second delay and 25 slippage. 
I'll hit start again, and that should start up that. And here they come. Boom, boom, boom. And you can easily sell your coins. Let, let me go into the candlesticks to see the one minute candle so you can see the chart a little bit better. There we are. And here is where you can actually do the buy and sales of your actual token. So let's say if I wanted to do like 50% of that, I can. And uh, I simply can keep track of what my activity is. Currently there's 0 0.09 activity in the contract. That's, that's literally, that's not my wallets whatsoever. Uh, so if I was to do a complete uh, sell all, which I'll do right now, um, I should be afforded a little bit of profit from whoever who jumped into the contract. So now you can see that there's zero holdings whatsoever. All my walls are currently out at the moment. Uh, these did come in and they sold a little bit later. And so if I go back now, I can actually hit in launch. Are you sure you want to in launch? Confirm. And here we are. So now we go back to our overview. And uh, the overview for this was literally uh, was, I'm not even sure if I was in profit or not in that. I mean, it was just simply a test, but you can see literally how easy you can control a, a matter of different wallets here, you know? Um, let me actually bring this over a little bit so you guys can see this a little bit better too. Second. Okay. So I just brought it over so you guys can see the charts a little bit better here. Uh, what we have here again is simply this particular Kinesis setup, which is super beautiful. You have literally hands on volume reports, coin reports, uh, right at your fingertips, your history of your profit and losses. Um, if you see something here and it's not showing up, I believe it does take a little time to show, but it will show up your, your P and L. And again, if you're deving, you're not going to get too much losses due to the fact that you're buying from the ground floor. Um, so if you could only imagine, you know, the type of uh, type of weight that you'll have in order to be able to make some crazy gains with this. Now, right now, as you can see, I have all my money currently in these wallets. If I simply wanted to withdraw back to like a re my, my regular funder, I'll go ahead and do so. Let me go ahead and grab that public key. So I'm going to go over to that. We'll go into receive, copy. So to simply do that, you click on this plus tool again, hit withdraw. You can literally select all your wallets like this, right? And then from there, just put the actual public key there where you want it to go and hit confirm. And then the voila, that is literally it. You don't have to do anything whatsoever besides that. Um, and now what I'll do, just, just to show you guys even further, uh, the transaction sent back to the actual soul scan and we'll do a refresh on Kinesis just to show that that data is also um, showing empty as well. So if we go back here, if I hit refresh on this, that one said 2.8, as you see now it says zero. And I'll go back into my wallet that I put and boom, the funds are now have been added back to, to the stash. Uh, just remember when you do a, a coin, you are going to uh, spend at least 0 0.05 when it comes to, I believe 0 0.03 to 0 0.05 in between there uh, for basically fees, um, pump fund fees or transaction fees whatsoever. But beyond that, everything else is the sky's the limit. Um, a lot of times you're going to see a lot, a lot of videos where these guys will quickly just do launches and you'll see the screens moving crazy fast. In general, what's happening here, just to kind of give you a little breakdown, is they're using the task sets, right? They're going into new tasks, and then from that point on, within the actual volume parameters, once they come in, they're just simply buying and selling and buying and selling. There's not an automatic process, per se, at least with this bundler that allows you to automate the buy and sell process. I'm pretty sure they're working on that, but it's simply a way to build... Uh, or an organic floor, so to speak, without having to, uh, by having more manual control, really, if you think about it. Now, you can create, like, certain different profiles. So, for example, if I didn't want to set up this information right here over, over, and over again, I had, like, a certain, like, you know, uh, volume information I want to say. Let's say, for example, uh, the mint here. We'll just choose a random mint, right? Um, 
And you know what? Actually, we'll do this. We'll just copy the one that we just used. Boom. And we'll place that there. And then we'll put the minimum buy as point, let's say, 5. And the maximum buy, let's say, is point 0.9. The delay will be, let's say, 4 seconds. And the slippage will be 50%. So with that being said, I can actually um, save this. I can save this for later, basically. So by hitting plus here, and then I'm going to save it as my volume, right? Just like that, simple. Maybe with a little dash, my volume. I want to make this public because it's mine, save. And then now, like for example, if I come here and I go back to my volume, boom, it's already there. So theoretically, when you are in the charts, you can have your profile set up to be your particular criteria. Boom, start it with whatever wallet you see fit that's already been preloaded. Pre Mind you, um, you know, I'll do, I have a, the video that you saw before on how to do all that stuff. It does sometimes take time for the mixer to mix in these correctly, but once that does happen, you're ready to rock and roll. And the program is super, super easy to use. It's probably the most simple bundler I've ever seen. Um, and that's even on top of the t Telegram bundlers, just to be completely transparent and frank with you. Um, but yeah, with that being said, you have access to uh, pretty much everything. All you need to do is simply have the funder wallet, which is where you're fund sending the funds. I set that personally up as the not only the wallet that I fund the uh, the, the, the uh, wallets with, but also in my settings, I also have the same wallet as a private key for in case I delete or I want to receive funds. So what happens is they've built a protocol where, let's say, for example, there's money in here. If I go in here and I delete it, um, it'll literally send money directly, whatever's left in there, into that, like, backup say, you know, private key which again is the same funder so just to sorry this just it's my funder wallet which is the distribution wallet so when it goes it also comes back to the same place um this much allows you to kind of be mind free of like oh shit where's my money you know like that's the worst thing when you're working with 25 35 45 soul and you're like what the fuck what the fuck's going on right so what i'm going to do is i'm going to be continuing to kind of shield and kind of go over this particular bundler because I really love the setup of it. In my next videos, I'm gonna guys I'm gonna go through on um, different techniques and strategies. If you have any questions, you can obviously reach out to me in my Discord. I have a, a full Discord with worth of uh, people that are bundling and wanting to learn that process. And I'm I'm, I'm there to help. So again, I'm not a financial advisor, it's not financial advice. I'm simply a guy on YouTube just showing you guys the ins and outs on this particular bundler called Kinesis. I'll give you guys more strategies and some case studies of actually proof of concepts and things going on in the market, in a live market setting beyond just this whole tutorial thing here. But if you like what you see, put a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, guys, and I'll speak to you guys very soon. Thank you so much, and I'll talk to you later. Uncle Warren the Guru signing out. Deuces.